Hi, I'm Drew Ellis from ALS. I'm representing you. You can get me off, eh? Heard you done this before. Heaps of times. Your wife and half the people there are giving evidence that you two fought and that you pushed her deliberately. She's getting in my hair. Not mine in the place. You understand, right? You're better off owning up. You know, showing that you feel sorry. Feel bad for what happened. You're more likely to get a better sentence. I've got no record for this. I'm not going to jail. I can't guarantee that. Do you understand? I mean, it's your choice if you want to plead not guilty. But if you do, and the magistrate believes that the witnesses are telling the truth, he's more likely to send you to jail for longer. You deserve to burn in hell for what you did. You shouldn't be talking to my client, Ellie. You're nothing but a coward. You go on and leave me be. Or you'll get what's coming to you, too. Walk away now, Ellie. See that? I'm you. sick and tired to draw. She... You haven't seen what he does hey, to him after time. I know. You know just end but you can't one. just hit him. What? You, you want to lose your career? Like he could lay charges. Right? I am a no. witness, Ellie. He doesn't right. care. Look at him. Hey, can't let right. him keep winning. Just like oh, you let me win hey. right now. Walk away. Now. Oh, you rot in prison. I want her arrested. She hit me. You saw it. You have to say. Yeah, you're right. I have to say what I saw. And I will. She slapped me. I can't have no white woman slap me and get away with it. So let's lay charges, and then we'll take it to court. Yeah. But if they ask me what I saw, then I have to tell them that I heard you threaten her. So let's talk to the police, and then we'll talk about your plea later. My client has no record of assault. He has, in fact, only a minor record for driving under the influence. He is doing the right thing by pleading guilty to the charge. He's saving the court's time and the witnesses' distress, Your Honour. Uh, even though he asserts that the worst of the assault, the pushing into the fire, was an accident. Uh, my client regrets the altercation with his wife Mr. Williams has employment and his family to support him through the process of giving up drinking, Your Honour. Thank you, Mr. Ellis. Whether or not you intended to burn your wife, Mr. Williams, it was your violence that caused her to land in the fire. It was your violence that caused her permanent and severe disfigurement. What you have done cannot be undone. Do you understand that? I sentence you to three years in Broome Prison with a non-parole period of 18 months. That is all. You've got to have the language as well, and it's such a, um, an honourable thing that, as an Aboriginal person, could have. Not many of us do have our culture, and for us to, to have the opportunity to, to get that back, it's such a powerful thing. What we do is, it's rewarding. I mean, it's giving back to the community, doing something that we're passionate about, and it's our culture. We would like to thank you all for inviting us here today. Thank you very much. Found it!